Hi, I'm Kevin Michalowski, editor of Concealed Carry Magazine. In this edition of the USCCA Gun Vault, we'll take a look at the kel P11. This was my personal concealed carry gun for many years. The kel P11 bills itself on the kel website as the first double action 9mm polymer pistol built specifically for concealed carry. Came about during the Clinton gun ban years when we couldn't have more than 10 round magazines and that gave us a whole bunch of concealed carry pistols because why have a big huge pistol if you could only have a 10 round magazine? So people started making smaller, lighter pistols and this one tips the scales at just 14 ounces with a 3.1 inch barrel and 5.5 five and inches overall length. It disappears on your waist or in your pocket wherever you choose to carry it. What I really like about the kel P11 is the simplicity of this pistol. It's a double action only pistol that operates without an external safety, but still gives you second strike capability because there's a shrouded internal hammer. Nothing to get hung up on in your pocket or in the holster or on your clothing, but if you need a second strike capability, if you get a bad primer or something, just pull the trigger a second time, you might get that round to go off. If the round doesn't fire, then do an immediate action drill. Tap, rack, get back in the fight. The kel P11 is super simple to take apart, but you will need one round of ammo or at least a spent shell casing. We're using a dummy round here with the pistol locked open. Just simply hook the rim of the cartridge underneath the disassembly tab and the disassembly pin pulls all the way out. Now release the slide stop and the slide comes apart. You have a captured guide rod and the recoil spring inside here and the polymer frame and steel rails that the pistol runs on right inside. This is all you should have to do to take your pistol apart. You don't have to disassemble it much more than this. Take the barrel out and clean it, clean the internals and put it right back together. Just slide the slide on, lock it open, make sure that the barrel is lined up with the pin, drop the pin in, run your function check, and you're ready to go. The kel P11 pistol has an MSRP of about $350. It's very affordable and it's completely reliable. Like I said, I carried this pistol as my everyday carry for many years. The only reason that I changed up to a Glock 19 was a departmental policy where they suggested that an officer's off-duty weapon should be substantially similar to his on-duty weapon. So I shifted over to a Glock for everyday carry. But this gun now serves as my backup gun. It's light enough to go right on my vest it disappears, I don't have any trouble carrying it anywhere I want to, and I would certainly bet my life on this pistol. I'm Kevin Michalowski, editor of Concealed Carry Magazine. If you like these videos, please remember to share them with all your friends, and subscribe to this page. We'll give you more great information about guns from the USCCA Gun Vault.